Welcome to my CNC router project. Let's look at the technique I'm using to lock the Acme rods in place. It might be easier if I start by showing the finished part. And here's the model of the assembly. The Z axis is sitting on the Y axis. The threaded rod is half inch and the 6201 bearings are just shy of half an inch. So we're going to have to grind a shoulder that will keep the rod centered and locked in place. This is my grinding setup. I have the Acme rod locked in two places that should keep it to a 90 degree angle where I'm grinding. We're re-grinding a larger shoulder on this rod to hold a double bearing and locking collar. Once the correct depth is determined, the set screw is locked. I only take off a small amount at a time and test often. I'm using a pen to show where the high spots are. This makes grinding easier. Just a bit more and I'll be ready. The files for all the 3D printed parts used are on Thingiverse. It takes a few tries, but a good fit can be made with this method. Up and down seem to work just fine. Here's some shots to show where my CNC machine is right now. Thanks for watching. See you next time.